So guys, uh, people criticize for what I say, but then on a daily basis, uh, my opinions get confirmed. Let's talk about cars. Guys, when I commute from uh, Northern Virginia to Washington DC, it's a 30 to 50 minute drive depending on the roads I check. I want to go fast, I take the toll road. I want to be in the middle, I take the highway, it's all straight. But sometimes I decide to pleasure myself, that sounds so wrong, by taking the back roads, which are more twisty and fun. On my way on the back roads, I'll get through a section of Northern Virginia that is called Great Falls, which is like the Beverly Hills of Virginia. You have the $10 million mansion. And it is very usual for me to encounter a Lamborghini, a Ferrari, a McLaren in front of me on the twisty roads. So here's the normal way of thinking of an Italian. Especially of a boy. Let me put on a lower gear. Let me rev up the car. Let's see if I can keep the same pace of the Lamborghini in front of me in my little Mini or my little BMW. We get towards the twisty sections and you know what happens? Absolutely fucking nothing. The Lamborghini is going slower than my grandma in her little Citroën C3. My dear PewDiePie, if you're spending $350,000 for a supercar, perhaps you should use it for what it was supposed to be used. To put a fucking smile on your face! Now, I'm not against using a supercar for commute, because I would. But, you're a Lamborghini, you see a twisty turn, cazzo, cazzo! You know why this makes me angry? Because uh, there's high demand for the supercars. I know it sounds strange, but there's a lot of demand for supercars. So much that people that want to buy one get to put in a waiting list. What these people are doing is uh, taking away a spot from a person who would be using the car as the way it should be supposed to be used. But right now, Ferruccio Lamborghini is turning himself around in the tomb for people like these. And this goes again into back into my discussion. Most people buy premium and supercars, not because they actually want it and actually are passionate about what you're buying, but simply because the society tells them that that's what they're supposed to be doing, or to simply show off something that they're not, because in most cases they get loans and then they bring the car back because it gets impounded. But that's another discussion for another day. Who am I to speak? Just a person who worked for Lamborghini and who is an Italian who lives in America, porca troia.